it's interesting how the U.S. government claims to be against war crimes and pro-human rights while supporting various governments that commit a lot of war crimes and violate a lot of human rights. Internal determinations here at the State Department. I, I would say you've come out much more quickly than, than that. G given the amount of time that the, the, the bombing has been going on in Gaza, you've had enough time. You, you, you've had more you, time than you, in some cases. We have had. not seen Russians warning civilians to vacate apartment buildings when they launch them. Um, we've, seen, we've seen evidence in Russia's case of deliberately targeting civilian infrastructure. That's the, so well, you have that's made some we, kind of assessment. What we, no, I'm saying. But the Israeli government is also deliberately targeting civilian infrastructures under the claims that there are either like Hamas terrorist station there, weapons or whatever in that building. So that is an obvious lie. Okay, I'm saying that's obvious. the difference. The difference in the situation, facts that we haven't seen here. But, yeah. oh, but, but the fact that you have made a determination because you, you what you just said, Simon, is that, that you made a determination that Russia deliberately targeted civilian, and you have made a determination no. in this case mm -hmm. that Israel is not no. deliberately doing that. The, you're, you're, that the, I'm sorry, I, I don't not see. A, there's, not, there's no other way to read what you. No, uh, to, to, to again, to, we were able we were able saying. to show and in, and in, in make the determination in the case of Russia that they were intentionally targeting civilian infrastructure. We have not come to that conclusion here. No. Okay. With Israel, but, with Israel, yeah. Okay, so that means that you have thus far determined that. Israel is complying with the no, laws of war. No, it, do, it, do, it, does, it does not mean that. It means that we have not conducted, again, Matt, I know you can, want me to, to, to make a claim no, I, that usually is at the end of a formal legal process, and I'm not, but, not but, able no, to do that. I, I don't think that's correct at all. And it, In fact, it's exactly as Simon said. You guys are very quick off the bat to accuse Russia of, you know, and probably correctly uh, of, of, of committing war crimes and doing that kind of thing. So, but in this case, and it's now two, two and a half weeks in, you guys are saying, you guys won't say whether you will make a determination, even though many others have. So, or many others have weighed in, either on the yes, they are complying, or no, they are not complying. I'm saying and, we- And so I think that what the world is looking for is a clear, statement from you guys whether you think that they are heeding your advice and it sounds to me as though you're saying yes they are but uh, you then when but when you're pressed on that uh, you won't give uh, an answer again we believe they are listening to our advice but i cannot make the formal i just cannot right. make the formal determination when it comes to, to every one of the strikes that's been sorry, that's been sorry, launched no, I'm, no, I'm, sorry, I'm, sorry, I'm, sorry, go, go ahead site go ahead and then we'll, very quickly so you're saying, i do want to give other people yeah, a chance you're but go say, ahead you're saying that dropping leaflets on people. I'm sorry. Like say, dropping leaflets on people, telling them that we're going to bomb this site, like three or five or five minutes before, is actually complying with the laws of war. Uh, is Sa that what you said? Said, I am not able to sit here at this podium and talk about the specifics of no, every. Said all, said, said, I, I let you finish the question. Let me finish right. the answer sure. of every individual strike to make a determination of a war crime. You need to be able to do these very fact-specific determinations and compare them about what international law requires and see if the international law has been violated. I'm not able to make that assessment. Certainly not as as you know with with facts that you were giving to me about. So is he saying because the Israeli government uh, sends out so many missile strikes that he can't determine if they've committed any war crimes like what about the attack on the convoy that killed a bunch of people whatever no, strike you just said Here. they informed them i'm 